There is nothing more annoying than hearing something buzz around your head or ears and no matter how hard you try and kill it, it does the same annoying thing repeatedly. You suddenly feel that sharp needle pinch hard on your skin. A damn mosquito, that tiny little annoying sucker of a creature, called the mosquito. In this video we discuss everything about mosquitoes and the home remedies that are free or inexpensive to use. Hey! Thumbs up this video and subscribe. Promise it's free. Mosquitoes need blood to survive and the average lifespan is usually less than 2 months. Males seem to have the shortest lifespan of 10 days compared to females. Females lay their eggs around every 3 days. Mosquitoes thrive in humid and wet surroundings. Some species of mosquitoes also carry and transmit viruses, this depends on your location as well as what type of virus, however not all mosquitoes carry viruses. The best home remedies for mosquito bites, of course, are those that stop the little critters biting in the first place. However, once you have been bitten there are many home remedies that will help ease the itchiness. A mosquito bite is not like the sting of a wasp or bee which is an injection of poison. Mosquitoes just wants a little taste of your blood and for them to easily drink it, they inject a protein which causes the itchiness, therefore, that protein stops the blood from thickening. It's this deposit of the protein it seems that some people get bitten constantly and others never have a single itch, however, this is probably nothing to do with whether the insects like you. The truth is, that some people do not get allergic and so they do not know they have been bitten. Here are some of the most popular home remedies that work. Use ice, apply an ice cube to reduce the inflammation and temporarily numb the area. Ice also restricts blood flow which may reduce the allergic reaction. The bite will probably itch again later, but maybe by then you will be busy doing something else and will not notice. Roll on antiperspirant, most commercial antiperspirants contain vasoconstrictive substances which, like ice, restrict blood flow to the area. Additionally, the aluminum in the antiperspirant may help the bite to heal. Do not use if the bite has been heavily scratched. Fingernails, press down on the bite with a fingernail so that the nail digs in and leaves a mark. Then do the same thing at another angle to form a cross. This should temporarily stop the itching. Toothpaste, some people recommend smearing toothpaste over the bite. The fluoride is said to reduce the allergic reaction. If desperate, why not give it a try? Scratching, it has been shown that if you go so far as to open up the bite and make it bleed, some of the allergen may be forced out by the blood flow. However, the bite may become infected, so doing this deliberately is not recommended. If it happens by accident, apply antiseptic. The good news is that the itching from bites will only last between 24 and 48 hours. Then, cover yourself in insect repellent or keep those mosquitoes out with netting to stop yourself being bitten next time. You can also look for an anti-itch cream that contains camphor, and keep it with you whenever you risk being bitten. Camphor can stop the itching and if applied early enough, it will even prevent the itchy bump from forming. This makes camphor one of the best home remedies for mosquito bites, but you have to buy some ahead of time and leave in your cupboards, this will last you a very long time. Apple cider vinegar, is another great antiseptic that helps with the itchiness. Simply apply a dab using a cotton bud over the bite, and this will relieve the itchiness. Hey! Subscribe! We have awesome free stuff coming soon.